kids. I miss you. But I have a story for you that you can watch while you're at home with your parents. Maybe you can explain it to them if they don't understand. This is the season of Lent. Lent is the time when we get ready to celebrate the mystery of Easter. It is the time when we are all on the road to Jerusalem. But who will show us the way? Jesus will show us the way. Every year, the people of God went up to Jerusalem to celebrate the feast of the Passover, to remember when God led them through the water to freedom. This year, Jesus was on his way to Jerusalem And he stopped to rest in the town of Jericho. Crowds of people heard that Jesus was in Jericho and they came to see him. They wanted to hear him teach. Zacchaeus was the chief tax collector of Jericho. Nobody liked Zacchaeus. He cheated them and took too much of their money, so he was very rich and everyone else was very poor. Zacchaeus wanted to see Jesus too. But he was too short. He tried to see him. He tried to jump up. He tried to crowd through. But the people wouldn't let him. And so, he climbed up a sycamore tree. When Jesus saw him, he stopped and turned to him and called Zacchaeus by name. Zacchaeus, come down. I must stay in your house with you today. Zacchaeus was so amazed that Jesus noticed him and he was so excited he couldn't help but jump down out of the tree and walk with Jesus to his home. The people were angry. They said, why is Jesus talking to Zacchaeus? Zacchaeus is a tax collector. He does bad things. He cheats and he steals our money. Why would Jesus talk to him? But Zacchaeus said to Jesus, today, I will give half of everything I own to the poor. And if I have taken anything that does not belong to me, I will give it back and four times over. Jesus said to Zacchaeus, Today, Zacchaeus, you are saved. You are right with God and you are right with people. Then Jesus turned to the crowds and said, I am the special son of God, and I have come to find and save all of those who are lost. I've 
wonder. I wonder why the people wouldn't let Zacchaeus see Jesus. I wonder why Zacchaeus wanted to see Jesus. I wonder what it was like up in the sycamore tree when Jesus noticed him. I wonder what it would be like for Jesus to notice me. I wonder what it would be like to take Jesus to my home. I wonder. What do you wonder? Hi kids, now we're going to read our story of Zacchaeus from our Bibles. But first, we will light the Christ candle. We always light the Christ candle when we read the Bible story to remind us that Jesus is always with us when we read our Bibles. The story of Zacchaeus is found right here in Luke chapter 19. I have a bookmark here, and the words are highlighted for you. Maybe you can cut the bookmark out on your activity page and put it in your Bible at home. Ask your parents to help you find the verse, Luke 19. Jesus entered Jericho and was passing through. A man was there by the name of Zacchaeus. He was a chief tax collector and was wealthy. He wanted to see who Jesus was, but because he was short, he could not see over the crowd. So he ran ahead and climbed a sycamore fig tree to see him, since Jesus was coming that way. When Jesus reached the spot, he looked up and said to him, Zacchaeus, come down immediately. I must stay at your house today. So Zacchaeus came down at once and welcomed him gladly. All the people saw this and began to mutter, He has gone to be the guest of a sinner. But Zacchaeus stood up and said to the Lord, Look, Lord, I give here and now half of my possessions to the poor. And if I have cheated anybody out of anything, I will pay back four times the amount. Jesus said to him, Salvation has come to this house because this man too is a son of Abraham. For the Son of Man came to seek and to save the lost. And that's our reading for today. Now it's time to change the light. The light of Christ that was just in one place at one time here on earth was changed so that now the light of Christ can be with us in many places, at many times, everywhere that we go. And we may take it with us. Here in this classroom, there in your homes, and out in the world wherever you go. <laughs>